Welcome back my YouTube family. Today I'm going to be making my calico beans and I'm going to be baking a ham. Stick around and enjoy the calico beans. We're going to first start off with browning the ground beef. So now I have my ground beef all browned and ready to go and make sure you drain off the fat because you don't want all that grease on top of your beans. So now I've put my hamburger into my crock pot and I like to make sure my crock pot's been on for at least a half an hour beforehand so it's nice and warm when I get started. I am gonna chop up an onion, and the recipe calls for a cup, and you wanna roughly chop this up. You don't want it to be fine. You want it to be a little hearty for your beans. And you can eyeball it. You can do a cup, you can do a little bit more, a little bit less. Do what your family usually likes. Yes, the recipe does call for bacon, but we didn't want bacon in the beans tonight. So you can definitely put bacon in. And I'm so sorry, you guys, I thought I was taping. But here I've already added my butter beans, my pork and beans, and my lima beans. And I don't like kidney beans, so I add two cans of the pork and beans. And the lima beans, you do have to drain. So now that we have everything in the pot, I'm just going to go over the other ingredients that I used. White wine vinegar, and that is three tablespoons of the white wine vinegar. And it doesn't matter what brand. Next thing you want to use is your ketchup. Um... You can use any brand you like, it doesn't matter. We are using Heinz, and you want to use, um, that's three-fourths cup of Heinz ketchup, or whatever ketchup you like, and one cup of brown sugar packed into the one cup, and you can use light brown or dark brown. Dark brown will give you more of, of a molasses flavor. And you want to use a ground mustard or dried mustard, and that is one teaspoon of that. And don't forget, one cup of onion. Okay, you guys, I'm gonna start cooking my ham. And I got my ham from our local grocery store, and it's a Cook's Pork Shoulder Picnic Ham. And I'm gonna put it into my aluminum roasting pan. I've already cleaned it out, and it's ready to go. Okay, you guys, now I'm gonna cover my ham with some aluminum foil. And you can use any brand you like. I like this one because it's the grill one and so it's extra wide. And then I'm going to fold it back and I'm going to add three cups of water. And I'm not going to add any glaze. I'm not going to add any 7-Up. I want my ham to be salty because I'm going to eat it as a side dish with my calico beans. And this is a six pound ham. So you're going to cook it... Um, 30 minutes per pound. So that's about two hours or about an hour and 80 minutes. And I also wanted to tell you guys, when you are cooking your calico beans in the crock pot on high, you want to cook them three to four hours. Okay. 
So I put my ham in at 350. You can do 325, 350. It really doesn't matter as long as you keep an eye on it. And I'm going to cook it for about two hours. And I'm just going to kind of watch the water in there. So you guys, thank you for coming to my channel and watching me do my calico beans and my ham. Please give me a like and please give me some comments so I can answer them for you. And we can see what we can do next time. I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.